Tonight at approximately 7.58 p.m., a uh, Seal Beach police officer initiated a traffic stop for a, tra a California vehicle code violation in the area of PCH and 5th Street. After contacting the female driver of the vehicle, the officer returned to his vehicle, noticed that the female driver had switched seats with her male passenger. The male passenger was now driving the vehicle. The vehicle took off at a high rate of speed and a pursuit was initiated. The pursuit ultimately ended up back on PCH after a short route through our Old Town area. From about the area of 5th and PCH to Studebaker and PCH, the driver was driving the wrong way driving on PCH, way driving, on northbound, PCH. In driving northbound into the southbound lanes and then moved back over into the northbound lanes. In the area of PCH and 2nd Street in the city of Long Beach, a traffic collision occurred with a suspect vehicle and eight other vehicles. After the traffic collision, the suspect exited the vehicle and fled on foot. The officer deployed his taser, which was effective in stopping the suspect. He was taken into custody. The suspect was injured during the traffic collision and he was transported. The female passenger was injured during the traffic collision. She was transported. They also had an infant child in the car who was transported to the hospital for evaluation. In addition to those, the suspect, female passenger, and the infant being transported, six other occupants of the involved vehicles were transported and one uh, passenger sustained injuries um, and succumbed to those injuries at the scene and was pronounced deceased at the scene. Were most of those vehicles parked at the intersection waiting for a light? Or have they gone through the light? Do we know? That information I don't have. All of those vehicles rem are, have remained on scene now, um, but I don't know what their original positioning was. Do you know if speed was obviously a major factor in this since you had so many vehicles involved and so many injuries? Long Beach Police Department is investigating the traffic collision since it occurred in the city of, uh, in LA County. Uh, they're here and they can speak to the traffic collision. I don't have information on, on that. Is Long Beach uh, the agency that's going to be taking the investigation on your pursuit end or California Highway Patrol? The pursuit will be investigated by the Seal Beach Police Department um, and the suspect's uh, involvement will be investigated by our detective bureau and the traffic collision will be investigated by Long Beach PD. You'll be canvassing the area for any uh, surveillance video regarding this, right? Absolutely. Ma'am, anybody that might have seen this crash, uh, we're going now into the morning hours. With an area code, what number can they call? We we'll say that one Anybody more time. Anybody that witnessed this crash, maybe can help investigators. Uh. I'm not quite sure who All right, you've been listening to a live uh, press conference from Julia Clagby with Seal Beach PD. This was a terrible collision at the end of a high speed pursuit. You heard the details where a woman was pulled over, then she switched seats with a male in the passenger seat, and then he took off. And that's what eventually led to this terrible collision at this intersection in Long Beach. Nine vehicles in all were involved. There were six injuries in addition to the two people in the car and the infant in the car that was running from police and there is one fatality. We're trying to get more information. We'll of course bring it to you, but this is a, a terrible end to a police pursuit that happened this evening. In fact, we have more breaking news to get to. There have been a number of police pursuits today. This pursuit crash in downtown LA and Chris Christie is overhead near 7 HD. Chris. David, a two car crash at the end of a pursuit here in downtown LA along Main Street and 2nd. Main Street shut down at the end of this chase where that car slammed right into that light pole. LAPD's noon division chasing the suspect just around 9.45 this evening. Three people hurt in this crash, all three taken to the hospital. Reporting from Air 7 HD, I'm Chris Christie, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.